two, one, go. We're so quirky, I swear to God. I already know that Help of You is gonna hate me for this, but I think, by my point of view, first milk and then cereals. So I will quickly um, explain what we're gonna do today. Uh, we're gonna start uh, our day studying a bit at home, and we mainly have two uh, subjects to do today, which is OIIS, which I have to complete an assignment for. And operation research, at which we have a tutorial at, at one o'clock, and we will have to go to uni uh, to do that. But first, uh, let's finish breakfast. So today is Tuesday, and we will start doing some OIS, then and then we'll we'll go to campus to do do a tutorial of operation research, and then tonight calcio, which stands for football Italian. So yeah. This is gonna be our day. For OIIS, we will have to write an essay. Almost completed. We just need to write a conclusion. So I hope to be done with this so we can submit today because the deadline for this is on Thursday. OIIS is a subject that concerns innovation and how you can protect innovation. How do you uh, collaborate? What is the development for uh, an innovation? How do you um, the development cycle for each innovation? What is the lifetime? of a product and all this kind of stuff. So I will have to write this conclusion and it will take me an hour or something like this and we can start operation research. I'm done with the essay and now I'll start reading a bit of operation research and it's around 20 pages. And once I'm done with this, uh, we'll go to uni. <coughs> Right now it's 12.35, I think it will take like 15 minutes to go to uni, uh, of course by bike, that's how we do it here in the Netherlands. Uh, so I'm going there a bit earlier, so I have a bit of time to uh, meet my friends and do a little tour of uh, uni. Uh, but I'm honestly already starving, so I can't wait to go to the food court and have a nice pizza there. <laughs> What's up? Yo, Enrico, what's up? We're late for class, let's go. Let's go. How's it going? It's a beautiful day, no? <laughs> so lovely. You can see a bit of sun. Let's take the elevator. Thank you. 
Do you want to have a look inside? Yeah. Alright. Let's see if it's lectures or not. What are you doing? Class, today we will be learning about what we want to learn in Rico. We want to be kicked out of a unit. We'll get kicked out of uni. What are you doing? <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> I was worrying God you choose the only elevator that doesn't have a look of a campus. You'll see something <laughs> on, on the way back. We'll Usually there's a there's all the campus in front of the elevator. He choose the only one. I admire the walls in Rico. Hello. Hello. Do I sit together? Uh, okay. So now we're going to have operation research. It's a really interesting subject uh, because it's about using linear algebra to find real life solutions for logistics. So um, now we're going to have these two hours and then uh, we're going to go to the food court to grab some lunch. So fast. I love how people, everyone <laughs> walks by and. Them, that's and the thing. Kind of I don't even know if it's legal or not. Do, do you want to go here? Okay, come on, come on. Now it's. Two, one, go. We're so quirky, I swear to God. Yeah, but I already spent all my money there. Are you guys going to. It's so weird to be in uni without a mask. And go to bed. Right? There's no privacy here. <laughs> also, so many guys. Stop. <laughs> so, <laughs> you so can you stay quiet in a second? Thank you. I'm joking. So, <laughs> such a bitchy tone. That was my only problem with it. So, the Lucas Lounge is a place where you can come after class to relax and stay with uh, with your friends, with your course mates. It's a really nice place because you can meet people from older years, people that can help you with uh, with some courses, give you some advices for some subjects and all this kind of stuff. We have um, like we have a coffee machine, which is really nice. I usually take um, at least one coffee before going to class. So Lugus is a study association of my course, industrial engineering and man management here at the university, and you can be part of a committee. For example, I work on the company tour, and it's a really nice place to socialize and being around your friends. Hi. Bye bye. So are, are, are you going? Yes. What's the thing? See you, Enrico. See you.
So it's um, 4.59 right now. I don't know if you can see it. It's 5 basically. I've been studying for half an hour and I'll go at football at 6. But first, I don't think I explain yet what is my degree. So I'm studying industrial engineering and management. This course is part of the Faculty of Science and Engineering of the uh, University of Groningen. And basically, if I had to summarize this degree, I would say that it teaches us how to optimize processes and this can be any process it can be uh, a manufacturing process it can be it can be it can be whatever the best example i like to make to make people understand what my degree is about is say that we have a morning routine like the one we uh, we had this morning where we wake up and we go from our room to the shower uh, then we go back to my room to change to wear the clothes and then we we eat and then we we can go to school or work or whatever but what if we wake up, we are in our room, we bring the clothes with us in the shower, we change in the bathroom, then we go to eat, and then we go to work. This way, we optimize the process, we reduce the distance we have to travel, and we made our morning routine more efficient. So, of course, that's a really basic example, but it kind of makes you understand what I mean when I say optimizing the process. So, this, of course, can be applied to a warehouse or a manufacturing company, or really whatever industry you want. Of course, we have a lot of engineering parts so for example in this vlog I'm having fluid dynamics which is basically physics and then we have more managerial objects such as OIIS so yeah I think it was important to give you a quick explanation of what is my degree and now I'll study a bit more and uh, then I'll change and then we'll go to play some football Say hello to the vlog! What's up? Okay, 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 okay. So, right now I have a uh, two hours training from six to eight. I'm not playing with a team, that's why I came a bit later. So I came back from a two month injury. So uh, I'm, I'll be jogging a bit, running, uh, playing with a ball. I cannot shoot or do anything like this yet. But uh, yeah, it's really nice to come back, to, to come here after studying the entire day. It's, it's nice because I can relax a bit. And so it's nice to hang out with the boys, hang out with my friends here from football. We usually hang out after after training as well, and it's really it's a really nice moment to relax. We train twice a week on Tuesday and on Thursday. On Saturday we play a match on a football league, which includes many teams uh, here in the city of Groningen. So yeah, let's go. So I just came back and now I will have to go to the supermarket because I forgot to buy food and I will come back and finally have dinner. I can't wait, I'm starving. Let's go to Yambo. So today for dinner we're gonna have a bit of chicken, a bit of salad. Also, just to tell you. Ooh. Okay. Chicken in. Ciao, come on. Capito? Ciao, ciao, pure io. Ciao, ciao. Buonanotte. So, it's 11. 47. I don't know if you can see it. And I just took a shower and I think it's time to do a summary of, of the day. So right now my days were quite balanced because uh, with COVID we go to campus just three times per week which me personally enough time to re revise at home and then be ready when I actually had to go to uni. 
you may be concerned but with covid you may not socialize but as you can see covid measures here and so are not that strict so you still have plenty of time and space to socialize with as many people as you want and find a sport uh, like i do with football you're always gonna find some new friends and meet new people so if you are interested or you're wondering about and you would like to study here in the Netherlands, I would really suggest you to do that because the degree in general, we're all serious universities where you have to work a lot. For sure, if you don't put enough effort on studying, you will not get good grades. And we, if you balance your time between studying and having fun with your friends, then you will have a lovely time here. You will enjoy your time here in the Netherlands. It's a wonderful country. I'm really happy to be here and yeah so this was it for this video i hope you enjoyed it and i hope you had fun and see you to the next one bye Scandy. Come on, we are 25 instinct pizza 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 and coffee pizza and coffee pizza and coffee what a combo okay let's go now i take it back recording